Miss Teen Blue Bonnie. Oh, Miss Teen Sweetwater. Oh, my Lord, look at you. You haven't yeah. aged a minute. Oh, it's the backstage lot. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for making the trip. Oh, please, I would have driven a million miles to support those girls. <laughs> this must be your daughter. Oh, no, that's Ellen, my daughter's best friend. This is my daughter, Willa Dean. Wow. OK. Mm -hmm. That is Jennifer Aniston and Molly McNerney in Dumplin'. Molly McNerney. Which, um... She was, she looked so she perfect. She had a lot of fun. Yeah, she had a lot of spray oh. tan on. Oh, we had so much spray tan in that movie. <laughs> it's unbelievable. She had a great time. Well, you guys shot that in Atlanta. Shot it in Atlanta. Yep, where everything seems to be shot. And then when she went to Atlanta, guess who was home alone with the children, with the kids? Would be me. Jimmy. Yeah, it was me alone. So oh. I have one request. Oh if you, God! Another request. What? If you should ever put Molly in another movie, put the kids in the movie too. Oh. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, I see. See your that point. That way they go, you know, and then I'm yeah. home for the weekend and then you by get myself. A little weekend alone. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's so. This fun. movie is set in the world of beauty pageants, which is one of the great worlds. Yes, unmind world. Yes. And the moms are unbelievable mm -hmm. in this world. You play. One of the moms. I, I play one of the mothers, and I'm at, they run the pageant. Uh, I'm a retired beauty queen winner of, I guess it was 1992. Um, and, uh, yeah, and it's a movie about, you know, learning to love yourself and, and girlfriends and it's a love story, many love stories. It's a love story mainly with Dolly Parton. Yes. Love story between a mom and a daughter, between friends. And mainly, actually, at the end, it's a, it's a, it's a love story about Willa Dean learning to really just love herself and redefining what beauty is. You Willa know. Dean loves Dolly Parton. She listens she to her music. She loves her. And Dolly Parton is someone you love as well. Love Dolly. And is that a coincidence? Is that what drew you to this, or is it something that you intended? The all book along? was based basically the the book Dumplin' mm -hmm. was written by Julie Murphy, and Dolly is basically a third, like another character in the movie right. because they are so in love with her. So if if Dolly hadn't agreed to do the music, or we, when we said to her, you know, we would love for to have some of your music in this in this film, and she was immediately said yes. Well, that's great. Which is incredible. She was only supposed to write one song, and she ended up writing six. Well, the movie wouldn't have been made if she had said no. Did you know Dolly before this movie? I met Dolly one time about seven years ago and uh, at the uh, Tower Bar, and I sent her uh, and her friend that she was sitting with a glass of champagne, ah. which is that. And I met her, went up and met her that night because I'd loved her since I was little. You know, sang into a hairbrushes, sang into Dolly Parton. Right. And then I told her that I named my dog you after do have a dog. her, named Dolly. Dolly. Yeah. And then... How'd she react to having the dog? Because people sometimes... Uh, my wife, Molly, uh, has a lot of dogs not named after her, but she shares in it, and she doesn't love it. It's so funny you say that, because yesterday, Dolly and I were doing press, and, and somehow th that came Dolly up. Dolly the dog or the Dolly person? Dolly the person. Uh -huh. Dolly Parton the person. <laughs> and then she said... She, it kind of came out that she was like, I know when, when she said, you know, I, I named my dog Dolly after you, she's like, I didn't know how I felt about that. And I was like, oh, God, have I an ins I've insulted her. Because she's like, then the, the interviewer said, well, would you now, Dolly, get a dog and name it Jennifer? And I said, well, that's so not a dog name. <laughs> I mean, I've never met a dog named Jennifer. I never met a dog named Jennifer. No. If you had a dog named Jennifer, you have to be really hip or really out of it. Or just, yeah, just yeah. weird. Yeah. And then, uh, ter yeah, so I, I guess I, I've sli slightly offended her. And then I realized being na telling someone you named your dog after them isn't, isn't it's not, I don't think I it's insulting. I just think it's cute. She's if so you sweet. love the dog, it's, you know, it's not like we think of dogs like they do in the Middle it's East like or sloth. something. Not like a sloth. Yeah, right. <laughs> Even a sloth, I you think, just, would be nice. Uh, that's, they're cute, too. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I feel like we've covered a lot of ground. I, yes, again, I, I think we've cleared up a lot. I think you, gotta, you have 10, 11 months to think about our conversation wow. and to really embrace the meatball okay. as the new... Or who knows? I'm not opposed to I it. I also have one other surprise for you. Oh, there. Geez. Isn't it funnier if I forget the surprise, though? <laughs> yeah, let's let just show what the surprise was, and then... Oh, Jennifer, I'm surprised you. Dolly Parton is here tonight. <laughs> Dumplin' premieres Friday on Netflix. Wow, I love it when we can bring major celebrities together. We'll be right back. Thank you, Jennifer and everybody. Thanks for watching. If you liked that video, click the subscribe button. And if you didn't like it, well, you hurt my feelings.